Hello crafty friends, welcome back to the Crafty Seas. Thank you so much for joining us today. I'm on to share a quick de-stash purchase from the lovely Kaz. And Kaz has a channel on YouTube. It's Kaz0518 and I will leave the description and details down below for that. And she sent this lovely little card and she said, Sorry Ashley, I spelt your name wrong on the card, not a problem at all Kaz. And she says, Thank you for buying items from my de-stash. Happy crafting. Happy crafting everyone and thank you Kaz for holding your de-stash, there were some fabulous bargains. We had to restrain ourselves as we were running out of space in the craft room but we couldn't resist picking up some of the goodies. So I'll dive straight in and the first thing that we picked up are these beautiful buttons. Now I can't remember the exact prices but I can tell you they were really crazily cheap and great bargains so thank you again Kaz. So we got these beautiful buttons and you may have seen on the channel some ephemera we've been making using a punch and stamp set and putting some buttons in the middle so they'll be going to great use for that. And next up we got this cute stamp set with the little centre. I thought that was a great size for on ATCs. And next up is this lovely set of clear stamps. And they're Christmas themed, like little mini postage stamps. Sorry about the glare, they're super cute and just perfect for twinches. So looking forward to crafting with them. And sticking with the Christmas theme, we got these beautiful 3D Christmas tree embellishments. Absolutely love them with a little bit of sparkle and all the added details. And we also picked up these llama embellishments and we actually have a project in mind and we're looking for something like this so these are perfect thank you so much Kaz and we also picked up some of the llama washi tape and this absolutely adorable mini wee reindeer punch isn't that just cute? And we're going to use that with some double-sided gold card to make shaker inserts. And Kaz had utter bargains, complete bargains on her paper pads. We really wanted to take all the paper pads you had, Kaz, but we had to resist as, as I said, storage is getting to be an issue. But look at these beautiful, beautiful paper pads. You probably sh saw Kaz showing them in the de-stash, but... I'll just give you a little flip through as they're absolutely stunning. We've been enjoying making some sea themed cards and we're running out of background so these are perfect and that's why I also picked up this Take Me To The Ocean pad. Again it has absolutely beautiful 6x6 six six paper designs in it. So as we had a project in mind for them, that's perfect, thanks Kaz. And again look at this beautiful paper pad. This is a wooden capsule elements paper pad and the de stashes are a great way for you to try brands that you may not have tried before uh, at a, a really good price and also it, you can get items that you may not be able to get anymore or that might not be in season yet such as the, the Christmas items and things so it's been a really great way and We've enjoyed taking part in the de stash and I'll just give you a flip through of those paper pads. Some of these will be great for some autumn crafting we have in mind and some meal makes. And we picked up another paper pad because as crafters can we ever have too many paper pads? It's just a question of too little space. And this is a Christmas paper pad with some lovely poinsettia in it. And we have a Ponsetta die that um, we're going to do a tutorial on soon. So stay tuned for that. And these will be perfect backing papers for displaying them in little gift bags. And lastly, we picked up these alphabet sticker letters. And Kaz had a few. And again, I had to resist purchasing them all. But this particular set I thought had a Tim Holtz Halloween vibe to it. And I thought I could use the letter there's B and OO for boo and maybe ATC for on ATC cards. And 
things like that. So we purchased things with projects in mind and hopefully we'll find the time to actually get round to those crafty projects. So stay tuned to the channel to see what we make with our D-Stash goodies and please pop over to the lovely Kaz's channel. All the details will be linked below and please let us know in the comment section below would you have purchased any of these items from the D-Stash and what your favourite item was. And until next time, thanks ever so much for watching and happy crafting.